Hello, friends. I'm Derwood Zelke, founder and president of the Institute for Governance and Sustainable Development in Washington, D.C. and Paris. We focus on fast mitigation, strategies that can slow warming in the near term over the next decade and slow the self-reinforcing feedbacks and avoid the potentially irreversible tipping points that are right around the corner. This means cutting the non-CO2 short-lived super climate pollutants, methane, tropospheric ozone, black carbon soot, and HFC refrigerants. If we do this aggressively, we can cut the rate of climate change in half in the near term while we continue to decarbonize the global economy. It's my great pleasure to welcome you to the Climate Benefit Concert. You are going to watch an amazing show for the next two hours. You'll experience music and dance of different genres from different parts of the world. And you'll hear messages from eminent climate scientists and other climate advocates. But before we start, I'd like to say a few words about the reason behind the concert. You all know how climate change is taking a huge toll on humanity, but few of us are aware of how the melting of glaciers in the Himalayas are causing an existential crisis for more than a third of humanity. The Himalayas, which in Sanskrit means the abode of snow, are the third pole, the third largest deposit of ice and snow after Antarctica and the Arctic. The Himalayas are melting faster than any other part of the world. The melting of these glaciers is continuing to cause extreme floods in South and East Asia. The floods in Pakistan illustrate this point. The Pakistan flood drowned one third of the country and caused over 33 million people to become homeless. Many mega cities like Mumbai, Kolkata, Chennai, Jakarta, Ho Chi Minh City, Bangkok, and Shanghai are projected to be underwater by 2050. The melting is also threatening the life of the 240 million people who live on the Himalayan mountains and hills. Hundreds of thousands of these people have already deserted their homes and become climate refugees because of the retreating glaciers and the ensuing water crisis. The central and eastern Himalayas are projected to be ice-free somewhere between 2035 and 2050. These glaciers feed 10 of the largest rivers in Asia, and nearly 2 billion people depend on these rivers for their drinking water, for their agriculture, and for their hydroelectric power, while 3 billion people consume the food produced in these critical river basins. The rapid retreat and disappearance of these glaciers will have devastating impacts on these people and will destabilize the region and indeed will destabilize the world. So it is essential that we take immediate action to stop or slow the melting of these glaciers. We can't wait another 30 or more years for the climate to stabilize. We need to act now. Billions of lives are at stake. Fortunately, there is a potential solution that could slow and possibly stop the melting. And this is a solution that Dr. Leslie Fields and her colleagues have worked on for over a decade. Healthy Climate Initiative, in collaboration with Dr. Fields' Bright Ice Initiative and Climformatics, along with a team of brilliant scientists from all over the world, are planning a field trial of this particular solution on a Himalayan glacier named Chahota Shingri in India before it can be done at scale to preserve the rest of the glacial ice. 
The goal of this concert is to create awareness of the importance of the Himalayas and of this particular solution to influence the governments to take policies and projects to protect the entire cryosphere and raise funds for a field trial and the co-development of the potential solution to stop the melting of the Himalayan glaciers. This is the genesis of the Climate Benefit Concert. We welcome you to the concert and request you visit our website and that you consider donating as generously as you can to help this great cause. No amount is too small to help us. But perhaps even more importantly, please tell your friends, your family and your colleagues about this issue and raise your voice, demand projects and policies that preserve the cryosphere. We're all in this together and together we have a chance of keeping the climate and the cryosphere safe. Thank you for your support. Enjoy. While the world urgently decarbonizes, we're not saying you can skip that. You can't, we have to get to more sustainable solutions for energy and fuels. But uh, while we do that, um, you know, if we don't slow some of these terrible feedback effects, we're in big, big trouble. And there's really not much time left to make the difference. I've been hearing it remarked that the experts, this is the one field where the experts are more worried than the general populace. And you hear things, you know, we've been hearing things for years, well, we've got till 2100. And then, well, we've got till 2050. Well, this next decade is the last chance we have to make a difference. And more recently, I've been hearing, you know, we've really only got three years. It's tempting to just look at this and say, somebody else is going to take care of this. It's very tempting to say that. If not me, who? If not now, when? The solution is to try to replace that lost bright reflect device, that, that function of being able to reflect sunshine. Got a thin shell of silica around, uh, beach sand basically. It is hollow glass microspheres, but it floats. By the time we build up to something like one or two hairs widths of material on top of snow and ice, we can slow down the melt substantially. Every degree matters. Every degree is so worth fighting for. Reels. Short attention spans and instant gratifications are our guideposts. Globalization and our addiction to cheap disposable goods are destroying our world. Technological change, shifting demographic patterns, increasing urbanization and indiscriminate industrialization has taken its toll on the natural world. Man has exploited nature for its own selfish needs and the demands of an ever-consuming society has pushed nature beyond its natural regeneration cycle. Early man respected the power of nature and learned to coexist with the natural forces. With industrialization, we have destroyed that balance. As the nightmare of the last two years have shown, nature has a demonic power to destroy our world unless we learn to change our ways. The world was brought to its knees and the godlike human became mere pawns in nature's great game. It was a warning shot fired across the bow, which if unheeded will destroy the human civilization as we know it. Rising sea levels are destroying the coast. Deadly storms are ravaging parts of the world while other parts become parched and fields lay barren. Earthquakes, floods and fires have been increasing and the rising sea level from the glacial melt are threatening to drown parts of our world. Climate change has become an ever-present threat. Let's listen now and act. Let us spread the mantra of conservation, of healing, of respecting nature and stopping the climate change. 
Introducing Dohar. Dohar, the word in Bengali, means chorus. Dohar is a group of folk musicians from Kolkata, India, with traditional folk instruments of Bengal. The group was co-founded by Rajib Dash and Kalika Prashad Bhattacharya in 7th August 1999. Both the members came to Kolkata from the Barak Valley of Assam. Kalika Prashad and Rajib both were lead singers and leader of the group. Unfortunately, Kalika Prashad died in a road accident near Garub village in Hooghly on 7th March 2017. The remaining members of the band have continued singing under the leadership of Rajiv Das and they always feel the presence of Kalika Prashad in spirit, presenting Doha. <laughs> Jarule rakule dolle dolle brumurai, jarule rakule dolle dolle brumurai, uriya uriya sole, remuna ma rakuli bikuli kore, remuna ma rakuli bikuli kore. Anashilo jomine namia, ashma anashilo jomine namia. Tara chupi chupi kana kani kore, re hai re chupi chupi kana kani kore. Ashma anashilo jomine namia, tara chupi chupi kana kani kore. आकाशेर मेघा डाके गुरु 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 आकाशेर मेघा डाके गुरु 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 या मोर गुरु गुरु करे ने मोना मारा कुली भी कुली करे ने मोना मारा कुली भी कुली करे पाथाली पाथाली पुबाली बातासे उठाली पाथाली पुबाली बातासे मोना मारुरुर करे रे हाय रे मोना मारुरुर करे उठाली पाथाली पुबाली बातासे जारुले रखूले दले दले धुमराए जारुले रखूले दले दले धुमराए उड़िया उड़िया चले ते मोना मारा कुली भी कुली करे 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 Are you ready, Birali? Are you ready? 
here's to our global friends of mine. Now, we will listen to the Vance Classic, and I take this great pleasure of introducing Vance to all of you. 30 years old, Anji Anche, also known as Vance, lost his job as a journalist in 2016, used his last savings to start a thousand bird poultry farm to support his family. Floods killed all thousand birds, and droughts in the northern region of his country starved his father's 60 cattle to death. Out of desperation, it then dawned on Vans that climate change is real. He met Daniel, one of his university choir mates who had studied environmental sciences to start making music for climate change awareness campaigns way back in 2017. They admitted Tony, Jordan, Dan, Cyrus, and several other young musicians with whom they make music for environment and sustainable development activism. How interesting is that? Today they have been joined by several volunteers in Cameroon with whom they have created an organization called the Creative Artists for Nature and Sustainable, CANSAT. They performed in Ghana to support the conservation of the Guinean forests of West Africa in 2022 finished overall best performing band at the World Youth Forum Theatre in Egypt, won the best inspirational song at the Africa Overseas Awards, AOA, in Switzerland. With the five-song Green Music unpublished album, Vance Classic, ladies and gentlemen, is Africa's leading green music band. Our theme today is My Home Here and There. We will hear three songs, I must introduce these three songs to all of you. Save the Glaciers, Earth Song and Africa. May I introduce the songs to all of you. The first song, Save the Glaciers, is when the Himalayan glaciers melt, the consequences are global. There's floods right even in my neighborhood, in Dola, Cameroon. Vans is calling on the world to take urgent action to limit carbon emissions. The next song, called The Earth Song, which is composed by Vans Classic, Vans actually dwells on plastic pollution. He says, 8 million pieces of plastics find their way into our ocean daily. 79% of plastic waste is sent to landfills or the ocean, while only 9% is being recycled. The next song, Africa, is almost a tribute to humanity and environment because it says it's my home, it's our own. We have to protect its forests and biodiversity. Ladies and gentlemen, may I introduce the members of the band now. Anji Anjay, founder, lead singer and composer. Honore Pablo, arts director. Daniel Keyes, lead pianist. Jordan, accompanying pianist. Cyrus, lead guitarist. Tony, bassist. Danny Drums, the drummer, Daryl, backup vocalist, Gavin, backup vocalist, Jan Seaman, dancer, Ari Evelyn, dancer, Baby Claude, sound engineer. Oh. Very soon, 
global temperatures would reach three degrees extra. Of course, that's why we see floods, we see droughts. Yes, food insecurity is also one of those ills we, the world is battling with. One very common problem we have is plastic pollution which at our level we can do something about it each and every one of us i tell you a very short story i was in, on the creepy beach once that's in central africa in, in cameroon on a very fine saturday with the sun shining as usual i had a bottle of water plastic bottle of water you guys it's plastic water bottle of water you guys drinking right so after drinking my water thinking nobody was watching I dropped the bottle on the beach as usual behold Sam was standing by Sam the fisherman he gave me a tap on the back and said whoops pick up what did he say? Whoops! Pick up. Pick up would mean take that plastic bottle, dump it in the trash because we have to do selective disposal of our waste. From then on, I decided with my brothers and sisters, all we have is our voices and our instruments to start this campaign of making music that is encouraging people to protect the planet. We are only musicians. You are what you are. At our different levels, we can save the planet. My name is Wams, Mr. Classic. This is the Classic Band. If you are going to save the planet with us, ladies and gentlemen, let's do like this, everybody. Population, 
Et quand je flotte, à ne jazz au bruit de si I'm so Inondation, la sécheresse Gâteau rouge à la déforestation Yeah, 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 yeah Repoison, la planète Changeant, nos moteurs de pêche Pensons à l'avenir Notre planète Est en danger Souvent là Car L'avenir de nos enfants En dépend If you are ready to save the planet with us ladies and gentlemen Let's like this It is time for the people in green to speak with one voice, one voice. It is time for the people in green to speak with one voice, one voice. It is time for the people in green to sing with one voice. of a button, 
The world is at our fingertips and yet we are more isolated than ever. Technology, while the basis for survival during the pandemic, connecting us to our loved ones and providing some solace, has also confined us in small boxes where we only hear opinions that agree with our views and choose to perceive everything else as the other. Living in these narrow silos, the echo chambers have deafened our senses, where differences are something to be feared and stamped out rather than embraced. And this is where the creative world can serve as the Northern Star, guiding humanity towards the light, towards hope and redemption. Music is universal. It touches the soul and pulls at our heartstrings, even when we do not understand the spoken language. From the Himalayas to the Appalachian Mountains, musicians sing of the earth and the ordinary people and their struggles. They sing of the surrounding land and of our connection to the mountain winds, the gurgling brooks and the verdant meadows. As we listen to this world music and see the feet tapping dancers, borders are erased and the human soul rejoices as one. Introducing the Navabaja. Navabaja of Bhaktapur is an ensemble of nine different drums, which is played by a solo drummer with the accompaniment of four different pairs of cymbals, shwams, fipple flutes, and natural trumpets. The first Navabaja ensemble was founded by King Bhupendra Mala of Bhaktapur in 1696 to 1722, who attempted to combine all possible sources of musical sound for the praise of his favorite goddess, Taliju, and the well-being of humans. A little about the ensemble, the master drummers of Nepal is an official traditional drumming ensemble of Kathmandu University's Department of Music. Now, the ensemble consists of seven musicians, including teachers and students of the KU Department of Music. The ensemble was formed by the German Nepal-based ethnomusicologist, Gert Matthias Wegner, the former head of department. Among the master drummers of Nepal, there are several musicians capable of playing the Navabaja drums. So the role of the soloist alternates during the performance. The nine drums are always played in the following succession. Dha, Kavat, Dhaka, Dhimaika, Nakika, Panchima, Dhalak, Kavita, and Nagara. The artists include Ravi Kapali and Ujjal Kapali, Buddhalal Manandhar, Vishnu Bahadur Manandhar, Rajkumar Manandhar, Raju Humikha, and Abhaya Krishna Sreshta. Namaste, everyone. And uh, first of all, I would like to thank uh, Healthy Climate Initiative for this opportunity. Uh, to, um, for this opportunity to uh, let us perform in the Save Our Glacier concert. So we are masters, master drummer of Nepal, representing Kathmandu University, Department of Music. So the very first composition is, uh, will be played by Vishnu Bhadar Manandar on Khota. This instrument is uh, known as Khota and uh, the composition is called Dialagu. So uh, Dialagu is generally known as, or uh, we consider it as invocation to God of music and dance. Uh, our SOD even, uh, even uh, described this composition as a complex telephone number. When dialed properly, a connection can be uh, made uh, within the rhyme of God and uh, human beings. So we will now perform Dialagu on Khata by Bishnu Badur Manandar. And uh, let me introduce the band member. So from, uh, from our right, we have uh, Raju Hyangumika uh, playing Ponga on this composition. 
and then as I said before, Bishnu Bahadur Manandar uh, will be performing Khota and uh, our very respected Budalal Manandar he'll be uh, he'll accompany symbols and uh, I'm Abhay Krishna Shrestha I'll play symbols as well in on this in this composition on my left uh, Raskumar Manandar and uh, on very left uh, we have Ravi Kapali uh, who'll play Muali uh, Ponga on this composition so we'll start this composition thank you That was Dialago on Kota. So uh, the second composition is also uh, Dialago, and which I'll play on this drum. This is known as Kauki. Kau means this horn, a ram horn, and Ki means drum in Newari. So Dialago on Kauki.
So this uh, next composition will be played by Vishnu Bhadur Manandar on Dhancha and the composition is known as Tatali. So we'll start the composition. And in this composition, Robi will be playing Mualing, which is uh, one of the endangered or uh, rare instrument which nobody plays these days. So now we'd like to start the composition.
Now, so much is changing in the world, we're all aware of that, and you know, people react differently to change, but in permaculture there's a principle to creatively use and respond to change, and I think that's what's desperately needed right now. That's what a lot of you are doing, that's what we're trying to do. You know, we see change as kind of like a dance, right? You hear the music and it has the dynamics and you've got to learn the moves. You can't just keep doing the same thing. So obviously doing the same thing has led us to the point where we are today, but we need to start coming up with some new moves. So uh, this one's called Change, and we'll see what Mal's got in him. That nothing's for certain You never know What's around the bend In whatever you're dealing Just accept what you're feeling Cause there's no point in believing It will never end Cause it's changing Constantly changing In any situation Well, the only thing that remains the same Is change Like a change in the season Change is there for a reason Can't stop ourselves from moving around the sun and There's no point in complaining If it's stormy and raining You just gotta get an umbrella and play in the rain with someone hey! Cause it's changing Every moment changing Sometimes there's not much you can do no matter who you are, you just got to be cool with change Change is there, make the most of it Might as well use it for your benefit Like when your food goes bad, compost it And when there's no more planes, build a pirate ship and sail the sea you can do as you please Oh, but only if you know you've got to improvise your way through change Now even if you keep very still Be guaranteed that nothing else will Change it will happen to you Yeah, cause we got small change and big change A bit of loose change Slow change and fast change and a wind change We've got sea change and tree change and climate change You change and me change and a key change Change is all the rage, turn the page away 
from these strange out of flames The rage crazy days Cause it's about time we engage Start rearranging our brains out of these old ways Behaving like we're insane We've got to step out of our cages Worrying about our wages All the Asian stock exchanges It's time to turn the pages Don't be ashamed, don't wear the blame Just drain the main vein of the pain Take to the stages and become agents of change Yeah Thanks very much. In today's world, the havoc wrought by the indiscriminate use of resources has created a malaise that has affected every aspect of our lives. Mental health issues are on the rise and discontent is also on the rise. Nothing seems to satisfy or make us happy. As we rush through our lives, let us pause for a moment and tune in to nature's music through this segment on classical Indian music. This music is deeply rooted in the natural elements. Ragas reflect the mood of the diurnal cycle and the change of the seasons. Every note, every tal is harmonized to capture the indelible bond that man has with nature. Indian classical music originated from the sounds of the ancient Vedas and the natural world. The seven notes were born and became the ragas. The ragas are inextricably linked with the rasas or the emotions. When these ragas and rasas come together, they create a perfect harmony with the power to heal the broken and guide the lost. Introducing Anubhav Datta. Anubhav Datta is a singer and composer from Guwahati, Assam, who is pursuing his musical career in Mumbai since the last five years. He's a national award winner in the folk category and has won three positions representing his state Assam in the All India National Folk Song Competition, Kala Utsav, organized by the HRD Ministry, Government of India. He has also sung in the chorus of song, O Saki Saki, from the movie, Batla House, and B. Prak, Neha Kakkar, and other artists have starred in this movie. He has also given some beautiful singles with some renowned Bollywood record labels, which you will find on YouTube. A young guy who loves to dream and sing his heart out for the people and loves to work for the betterment of society. Party. 
lives in the world of music and is a proponent of Robindra Shongit. She has a melodious voice and her soulful renditions truly reflect the heritage of Tagore songs in their truest form. With her dedication and passion, she has earned love and respect from an avid audience in the Indian subcontinent. To her credit, Namita has several albums dedicated to Tagore songs. Namita is also a prolific writer and poet. Her poems are synonymous with divine love and romance with nature. Namita is a regular performer in the Kolkata circuit and in Shantaniketan.
by combining the choreographic intention and compositional form of dance with, of course, the language of cinema. The genre found its feet during the pandemic times as dancers and performers found themselves bound and locked up in constricted, confined spaces only to find release to the lens of camera. It is not surprising that many of these films that you would see responded to the stifling conditions of the pandemic. The limits imposed by the disbalance that came with the human nature divide in the age of the Anthropocene. We're delighted to collaborate with the team of Correo Mundo's Dance Film Festival, who curated films from around the globe this year based on the theme, The Crisis That Move Us, the two of our films in this section. This section of the festival is curated by Arts Forward, led by Marvin Kashar. Ladies and gentlemen, the greatest threat to our planet is the belief that someone else will save it. That's what Robert Swan had once said. This film, Pause, by Prashant Morey, is a short experimental film, an attempt to embody and reflect on the critical situation of marine pollution and commercial whaling. 
The film has been directed by Prashant Mori, music is by Benit Moitra, and the videography by Sandhush Gaikwar. Presenting Pods by Prashant Mori. Water Bodies is a film that was made as a five-minute artist's provocation for the panel on changing water, which was part of the Everything Change event by the Nissan Art Center, Swansea, in June 2021. It was an open-ended brief with just the impulse of water. Vikram Ainger began to think of water and bodies, water in bodies, water with bodies, bodies of water. The personage of water in our bodies, the physicalities of solidity and fluidity, and our relationships with rivers in India, at once ritualistic and respectful, as well as callous and contentious. And through it all, like a dark phantom, the hard hitting poem by Paru Thakkar that paints the grim and grisly picture of the ravaging second wave of COVID pandemic in India, where bodies of victims we discovered floating down the Ganges. Shavavahini Ganga, translation of Parikhakar's poem, is an inspiration to this film. The corpses spoke in one voice, all is well, sakuch changa changa. Lord, in your idle realm, the earth is now the Ganga Lord. Your crematoriums are too few. Fewer the wood for pyres, Lord. Our pallbearers are too few. Fewer yet the mourners, Lord, in every home. Yama performs the dance Makaba, Lord. In your idle realm, the hearse is now the Ganga. Lord, your smoke belching chimneys now seek respite. Lord, our bangles are shattered, shattered our hearts. The fiddle plays while the towns are ablaze. Va Billa Ranga. Lord, in your idle realm, the hearse is now the Ganga. Lord, your clothes are divine. Divine is your radiance, Lord. 
down entire sees you in your true form. If there be a real man here, come forward and say, the emperor has no clothes. Lord, in your idle realm, the hearse is now the Ganga. Water bodies choreographed and performed by Vikram Iyengar has been shot and edited by Kunal Chakraborty. The corpses spoke in one voice. All is well. Sab kuch changa changa. O king, in your ideal realm, the hearse is now the Ganga. Upche uthe shoshan, moshan, bhuri edhe kaat, shunno kore uthon, मड़ाय भरे सब मठ नाचे उदम मृत्यु दूती बाजे मरण लंका राजा तुम राम राज्य सब बाहन गंगा राज तुम्हारी धक धक दुणती चिमनी पोरो मांगे राज हमारी चुडली फूटे धड़ धड़ छाती भांगे बढ़तू जो फिडल वगाड़े वाह रे बिल्ला रंगा राज तमारा राम राज्य मा शब वाहिनी गंगा King, your clothes are divine. Divine is your radiance. O King, the town entire sees you in your true form. 
राज तुम्हारा दिव्य दिव्य तुम्हारी ज्योति आज के देश राज तुम्हारे असली आखी नगरी ज्योति मरते बोलो राजा मेरा नंगा आज तुम्हारा राम राज्य Ladies and gentlemen, presenting Dessa Quetera del Cuerpo, which is the disarchitecture of the body. This is a Mexican film directed by Gifeste Adelaide. The premise of this film was to place an actor or dancer in a natural space as a suggestion towards a possible course of action. With this as a prompt, the dancer Ivan Ontiveros developed a bodily exploration responding to the characteristics of his surroundings several choreographies arose from these explorations ladies and gentlemen and the disarchitecture of the body is one of them the greatest series was recorded just outside of san miguel de allende in an ejido called el vaca as a part of irantis directed by gipitsi adelai now i would like to introduce the crew direction by Gipitsi Adelai, cinematography by Alejandra Ratana, the direction assistant by Sheraz De Morales Moya, dancer Ivan Antiveras Antiveras, sound design by Alfonso Islas, Proyecto Moneskin Puel. The production year of this film, ladies and gentlemen, is 2021 and the duration is 3 minutes.
From Within is a film from Costa Rica of nine minute duration. It's about four chapters with women, body, and territory. These are concepts which are always in a flux and in dialogue, modifying each other. The work narrates the process taken by the community dance group in Los Santos, Costa Rica. From Within is directed by Maria Jose Veterano Salazar. Todos los cuerpos cuentan historias. Mi historia está hecha de retazos. Mi columna vertebral me sostiene. Las manos son muy importantes. La piel es la frontera del cuerpo. Permitirme sentir. Crecer con raíces fuertes. Espacio para ser una misma. Como una cicatriz en la tierra. El paisaje me pinta a mí.
Limas Utopicus is a Peruvian film of 12 minute duration. It represents a wide variety of ages, occupations, and social cultural backgrounds to express their visions of utopia using bodies and group compositions in this site specific video dance piece. Ladies and gentlemen, this video is a final product of a free four week movement workshop for non dancers offered at the Cultural Center of Spain in Lima, Peru, led by the multimedia creative duo of Adele Fone and Moira Silva, who forms a company Corpus Ideo. Working collectively, they explored how to defy in small and varied ways different aspects of the urban status quo in Lima, a city slowly overcoming and redefining a traumatic past with terrorism and public spaces. The video features collective movement and sound compositions created by Forney and Silva in collaboration with the 15 workshop participants.